In this video, I want to demonstrate how to make a section view from this auxiliary view. So first, I'll choose section view from the drawing ribbon. Then for the cutting line type, I'll make sure I choose the auxiliary view option. I'm just going to zoom in on my auxiliary view. I'd like the section to go through the middle of this cutout, so I'll select this and then I'll move over near the part edge. Just zoom in a bit more and I want to make sure I have the perpendicular relationship is shown here, so I'll click to add that and I'll right click to accept it. Just zoom out and now I've created a section view that's perpendicular to my part through this auxiliary view. I'm going to push escape once and again the cutting line here, if it's too big, I can select it, grab its end and just drag it back down and make it a little shorter. Make sure I maintain the alignment. I'll move this view's title a little bit. So when SolidWorks puts this hash marking around the view, it's telling me you've changed the section view line, which was used to create the section view. To update that, I'll just rebuild the drawing, and that will update this section view. 